I start to need a new haircut. We all had this experience where we wait at the barber shop and scroll through a book with different hairstyles. Okay, cool. You look nice in the photos, but how would it look in me? This is exactly the problem I'm trying to solve with Dream Booth, an AI that is capable of transforming any sentence I write into a picture. The best part is that I can just give it a few pictures of me and it does amazing things. Let's go. So now it's the part where it gets interesting. So I'm gonna write here a photo of man, that's me, with cool hair. Because I feel it doesn't work as well for me because I have glasses. I, I'm starting to, to maybe explore where the limits of AI. Ah, I see. A lot of the problems here, it's because of the... You see? The reflection of my... The reflection of my glasses. This blue filter. You can see in a lot of pictures here as a mistake. Damn, it didn't even change my hair at all. It's just me with my boring ass hair. It's just me with my hairstyle, what? It just doesn't work at all. Why is that? This is more entertaining than the photos it's generating, huh? <laughs> okay, now I'm trying with Mohawk. Come on, work with me, AI. It doesn't work. A Mohawk, it's not that. What if I just go bald? Ugh. I'm not even bald. What? Undercut. This doesn't work. It doesn't work. Maybe I'll have to resort to like a digital painting or something. Maybe it's too realistic. It's kind of eh. But maybe if it goes digital, it might work. After a few tries of the digital painting, here are the results. See, that's how camera distortion works. But you can kind of see now the advantages of doing this because after compiling some photos, it's like, mm, okay. See, again, this is way too short. I would not do this. Instead of me doing the mistake, mm, maybe I should go really this short. And having to regret waiting for the hair to grow out back. This time I can see and immediately identify the mistake. Like, never too short like this. This one's pretty cool, to be honest. This and this. I might go for something like that. I have a mirror over here and you're kind of supposed to see from the other mirror like from the back uh, Okay, it has to be way shorter here And there's no really proper technique to do this. I just kind of look and go it doesn't need to be perfect So some people sometimes ask me why I cut my own hair all the time. And to be honest, it's because it saves me a lot of money. Of course, I, I will never do as good as in a barber shop. But you know, it's it's decent. Okay, hair on top is way shorter. Let's do the sides again. No, <laughs> the glass, the mirror broke. Ah. Okay, I should be careful. I mean, I'm basically finished. The oh man, I don't want to clean this. Ah. 
look like it? Does it look like it? <laughs> Does it look like it? Hopefully. <laughs>